In this episode, I give you two tips on how to save money with a low income under three minutes. So stay tuned. Tip number one, get rid of debt. On this channel of DevQ, we always talk about getting rid of debt and how important it is to do. But in order to save properly, you need to get rid of the mounting debt and the interest that accrues on it, most likely each and every month, whether it be student loans, credit cards, etc. You need to get rid of certain aspects of that before you can even think of saving even just a little bit each month because especially credit card debt, this is a big one that we hit home so much in Dev Keel. The interest on many, many credit cards can really, really leave you in a vicious cycle of mounting debt year after year. Get rid of the credit card debt right now, this year, and then once you do, start saving about 25% of your income to save for a rainy day for your paycheck that you receive each and every week thereafter. Tip number two, analyze your gas and food expenses. This aspect of our life can be incredibly important in saving money because now also living in an era with COVID and everything else, we can maybe change our variations of how much we do travel, how we actually buy food and some in some circumstances get delivered to us and how you can maybe hone in on those aspects of those particular expenses because they do add up tremendously depending on where you live and especially with the economy the way it is. So analyze in which ways you can make that different and work to your advantage. And I would encourage people if they can, you know, have food delivered to them if it's conducive to their situation and you can properly estimate through that expense if it does reduce it. So consider heavily and analyze critically your gas and your food expenses. So those are just two really quick insights to help you save money right now, tackle debt, but really, really sit down and have the willpower and the discipline to actually implement and hone in that whole situation so that you can really cut back maybe 10, 15% just a month. That could be enough for your situation, but really rein it in and see what you can do with it. So please comment below. Are those two particular debt related issues deterring you to save money right now? If so, comment below and what you may be doing to maybe tackle each of those situations in a good and a very effective way. So please comment below, share with others, and stay tuned for part two of this part four series right here above. Take care, everyone, and we'll see you next episode.